we're real people, we have real business and stuff, and so we should face real problems because it's just a natural cause of the, in anything we do, right? Absolutely, and who who tries to, um, you know, uh, deceive or or do evil to a company that doesn't have any value, that doesn't have any potential. I mean, people see around the world that this company is really something else. It, it, it is unlike anything they've ever seen. And uh, so they're a target. Absolutely, they're a target. But I, I honestly believe that Ash has surrounded himself with a team that is going to move us forward. And he's getting back to basics. He even said it. Sometimes you have to go hit rock bottom and get back to basics and 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 just figure some things out that right. maybe some mistakes were made here and there. But I honestly believe he's got it. He's got it figured out, and we're we're looking good. Right, and you know, Adan, that, that's one of the things that, like earlier on, you said how much you've learned from Ash. Just like I would say to, mm -hmm. you know, his humility and honesty just makes it going because you're just like if he can say this so why am i doubting him he can't have to say even right. if we're not expecting him to say but he thinks that we need to know so that is strength from his side because some people might see that as weakness but that is strength i think that's what's keeping him going from my perspective well yeah his, like i said his faith is keeping him going his family's keeping him going his uh just his, his overall character is keeping him going. He doesn't give up. He is a very, very dedicated person. And he's uh, he's got a vision and he knows this vision will work. Mm -hmm. And he, he has a vision not only to um, bless him and his family, of course, that's what this is about too, but to really emphasize his blessing others. And, uh, you know, we see that in everything he does. He, he, remember he said, how am I going to spend $3,000 a day? I, what am I going to do with $3,000 a day? He'd exactly. give it away. <laughs> Meanwhile, there are 3,000 people suffering out there. They need just... Uh, that's exactly right. <laughs> that's exactly that's so right. true. One thing, uh, Dan, uh, that, that I would like you to touch on, which Mike made so clear on Sunday, we want to reiterate, is the fact that some people depend so much on deadlines. Uh, I think by the, on the first, we will be rolling apples out there and stuff like that. Is that really necessary at this point that we should be looking up to a deadline when we think out there? No, when you, when you, when you look at a company like this, that is so complex and uh, there's so many moving parts, you can give time estimates, but those are people, in my opinion, that haven't been engaged in the process that don't really know what's going on. They just have one thing, they have tunnel vision. They have one thing on their mind and that is, when is this gonna work for me? And when am I gonna get paid? And that's why people like that have to take a serious look at themselves. And they have to understand that this, is, this isn't all about getting paid. This is about being part of an opportunity that has never existed before. And if they can't understand that, then, then we can't help them but we will help as many people that want to be helped. But it's about, it, it, it's not about dates and uh, people, people always want to know when. And I believe that Ash is going to, I think when he says very soon, he, another thing that this is a key, he can't say anything like that. People are gradually understanding the, the legal process and what he can and he can't say legally. And he's got some advisors. He's got some very, very good advisors, both legally and that are on his team. And he he is being advised very, very well right now, I believe. So don't get caught up on on dates. Exactly. I mean, exactly. Just know, just know that it will happen. And you know, don't get caught up on dates. That's so true. Because you just want to be Where are you gonna go? Yeah, we'll just get to be excited about the big picture because it's just a matter of when, and the when is is just readily waiting for us at that yes. point. Yes, and we'll get there. Yes. You know, so I, I think it's it's a good thing. One one of one of the things, uh, you know, um, that he when you listen, even some of his quotes, he will say you should spend time like to to add some value to yourself, mm -hmm. and this is that time too because how much you learn from here, you will never it's it's priceless. You know, just about yeah, it. and and, and, and that's comes, one of the. 
Like, that's well, one and, of the advantages. I'm sorry, mm -hmm. I interrupted you. Go yeah, ahead. I was just one, going to say about the, the, the you earlier on your advice that we should listen to him. Because when you say listen, it means he says something one needs to listen in order to get him, you know. That's right. So what we do is not everybody gets it at the same time. And that's why we do this. Because if you come here, you you, you you comment on it from your perspective. Mike Ellis does the same red, red friend, the deaf guys, Michael Williams and stuff. When you listen exactly. to Ash, you don't get it well. No need to be anxious. Just go around again. And then you're fine. Okay? Well, and, and you know, that's that's a good point. I mean, like like you got, you found your niche. I mean, uh, Michael Williams, uh, Mike Ellis, uh, Marty DeGarmo, my partners, uh, we've been involved in this thing for for a long time since the beginning, really five and a half years. Uh, but um, and and I I found mine and Daryl Cook and Janet Butler and I uh, we started taking notes. So that's where I really started. I had to I had to learn to listen because I wanted to help people understand what Ash was saying. Try and try and take the notes and and uh, and and make them a little bit more concise for people to understand what went on in that meeting for people that couldn't get there. And so I developed over a period of time, the ability to listen to Ash. And there are some gems in there. there I mean, if you just really listen, I mean, I, the, the, quote I, the quote I said earlier, that, that was just, I mean, that just stuck out at me. And there's a lot of them, uh, you know, that, that just really, really have an impact on all of us. Yeah, that's so true. You know, because when you see, you, sometimes I just think that not getting it is a choice, because you, you and you and, and Derek Cook and Janet, you do that, and then other platforms like they came come again to break it down. Sometimes we myself, I do it in pidgin. I, I interpret some key things in pidgin. It's a language understood in many countries in Africa. So everybody should get at least the, the main points. If you can't listen, you go and read. So we just need to keep doing that. Yeah.